for days and days. I felt weak. I had low energy. I, uh, I was losing weight. I was so small. And I went to the hospital, and uh, that's when they told me I was diagnosed with HIV. It was hard for me to, to accept it. When I was a drinker, I didn't care about myself at that time. I was always mad. I was always losing weight and being broke and um, getting mad at my family. I felt evil. I felt such an evil person that that was not me. It was drained. It was depressing. It was sad. I wanted to commit suicide because I, I never heard about this disease. And for me, at the beginning, it was a little bit hard, but I got over it. I um, started going to counseling, the therapy, to healing traditional men. And when I changed my life around, I've seen bright colors, I see smiling people, I see, you know, like wonderful life we're looking at. And I wasted half of my life. Um, I'm 46 and I feel young and I feel wonderful. I like to meet people, I travel, I send messages to our young ones, to elders, to, to, to try to stay sober. I know it's hard for people that are stuck with it and uh, for me, I see myself as a brighter person. I myself pray for me and the women that are out there to become strong, to get their strength, to go back up their life again, to normal life instead of a miserable life. I've been hurt half of my life and uh, it's time for us women to say enough is enough.